Ugh. It's day six, the penultimate day. What? What? Don't get all sheepish now. Come in, you're shouting at me. Oh, God. It's the end of the world. Feed me, says Basil. Feed me. There we go. Set me up for the day. Nice bottle of cornflakes, cup of tea, glass of juice. Um, with a hidden Mickey thrown in just for the shits and giggles. So tired. <laughs> Ooh, look at the state of this sofa. It's about to be made worse. Mmm, canned soup. Everyday value tomato soup. Mmm. With 20% of your salt. It's a good job I'm actually not that hungry today. Yeah, I hope it's not that luminous red either. But, uh, yeah. Whew. That is quite a luminous. Kind of looks like hot lava, or perhaps a vindaloo on the way out. Hmm. Yes, even when warm, it does still look. <laughs> it's like the orangest substance in the world. It's like tango, but thick and soupy. Oh, that's sharp. Very tangy. <laughs> <laughs> Can't remember how much this is, but I'm going to be putting it on screen right now. But even that's too much. <coughs> Don't like that at all. No, 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 no. Don't like it. Don't like it. Don't like it. Don't. Currently watching a shameful sequel. Look at those dead eyes. Like a dog's eyes. And I'm very hungry. Very, very hungry. That soup was shit. It was very shit. Hated it. That was the worst. Was it the worst thing I've had? Maybe. Maybe. But either way, I'm starving. And it's time for dinner. And I'm going to go make dinner. Let's go make dinner. Chicken Kievs. Hmm, look right. Pretty decent size. So if you don't know what chicken Kiev is, it's bread crumbs, then chicken, then garlic butter, as advertised. I bet it's not that thick. 97 pence for these two. Um, and as the picture suggests, I have some potatoes. Curse the tinned potatoes. Um, 35 pence. That's quite a big bucket of potatoes. And last but not least, some uh, British garden peas. It's very important that they're British. 21 pence for a can of peas. Um, one of your five a day for half a can. So if I eat all of these, that's two of my five a day. Um, so there we go. I might get some nutrients yet this week. Turns out these potatoes explode in the microwave. Um, I might be leaving that one for Grace to clean up. This may be a bit too much chicken Kiev. <laughs> um, these look awful. Probably even worse than the last ones. These are like the least green peas I've ever seen. Let's try the crap stuff. Not a huge fan of garden peas. And that's uh, confirmed with these ones. Oh, they are so bland. Get off. And I'm hoping the filling gives these a bit of flavour. Because they're very... Not as waxy as the other ones, but they're not particularly great. Whoop, that was good. That covered me in molten butter. At least there's something in there anyway. Come on. Well, looks all right. Hmm. To be honest, 
that's really good. I wonder if I can just butter up my spuds. Well, it improves them a little bit. This is good though. I might just fill my entire dinner. Mm. One thing I haven't mentioned this week is that I've been drinking this as well. Double strength orange squash, 42 pence. Um, it's actually really nice. I mean, you kind of, you'll know what orange squash is. In goes the uh, squash. Let's do this one-handed. In goes the uh, bottle of water. Lovely. Mm, very orangey. I like that. And that was day six, the penultimate day. I am not going to miss this week. On saying that, the chicken Kievs was by far the nicest thing I've had all week. So good. I would happily eat that all week, just, just, I'd probably get sick of it after day three, but you know, I'd, I'd give it a go. No, I'm not doing it for the next week on. Um, really, really good. The potatoes and the peas, uh, bleh. but the Kievs were amazing with chips maybe instead, or decent potatoes. They'd be, yeah, that'd be a really good meal. I enjoyed that. Really good. 10 out of 10. So, um, that leads into tomorrow, the last day. It's not been as hard as I thought it was going to be, but I guess I will go over the conclusion tomorrow. So please subscribe, please like the video, and check back tomorrow to see what I think, and also how much I've probably gained in weight due to all of the salt that I've had this week. But um, hey, at least I've got some nice squash to wash down all the salt.